discover the intriguing connection between Oppenheimer, the man behind the atomic bomb, and the Bhagavad Gita. In the highly anticipated film Oppenheimer, Kareem Murphy portrays the complexity of the historical figure. Oppenheimer, directed by Christopher Nolan, has been praised as an intense and mesmerizing masterpiece. It releases worldwide on July 21st, captivating audiences with a brilliant storytelling. But what many may not know is that Oppenheimer drew inspiration from the ancient wisdom of the Bhagavad Gita. The physicist was deeply influenced by its teachings and even learned Sanskrit to read the original text. Oppenheimer considered the Gita to be a beautiful philosophical song and listed it among the 10 books that shaped his life. James A. Hegia, a professor of history, drew parallels between Oppenheimer and Arjuna from the Mahabharata. Hegia explained that Oppenheimer saw a connection between Arjuna's duty to fight in the epic and his own responsibility to develop the atomic bomb to defeat the Nazis. However, Oppenheimer also recognized the grave danger posed by the atomic bomb. When the Trinity test, the first successful nuclear test took place, he quoted the Bhagavad Gita saying, Now I am become death, the destroyer of worlds. Christopher Nolan, the visionary director, wanted to bring the audience into the room where these historic decisions were made. He aimed to explore the love, fear and complex relationships that shaped Oppenheimer's story. As the audience experiences Oppenheimer's journey, they may be less speechless and profoundly impacted by the weight of history and the human connections portrayed on screen. Oppenheimer's fusion of scientific achievement and moral dilemmas continues to resonate, reminding us of the profound influence of ancient wisdom on the course of human events. Join us as we delve into the fascinating story of Oppenheimer and the Bhagavad Gita, a tale that explores the depths of human nature and the power of choice.